Today's video, I'm going to break down a GPU and replace the thermal pads. I, I could say that this could be applied to all GPUs when breaking one down, but all GPUs are not made the same. Some uh, screws are in different places, but for the most part with your thickness of the thermal pads and, and repasting, uh, it's general, you know, look up Google what your thermal pads are. What I have done normally, uh, I will pull out my handy dandy kit uh, and I have a caliper, this is cheap, just got it off of Amazon and I'll measure the pads myself, just put it down right onto the GPU, figure out what the size is. Uh, I buy extra pads uh, typically, so you then can, um, you know, I just have uh, them available to put in. So I'm not, you know, worrying about ordering, things like that, of having a GPU down for too long. Uh, but, you know, with this process, again, it, not all GPUs are the same. You can also look on YouTube, you know, break down a particular GPU breakdown. So you can watch that video and, and see, uh, you know, basically just type in your GPU breakdown or your GPU uh, part, pull apart, you know, something along those lines. Uh, but yeah.
story with changing, swapping out uh, the graphics card or the thermal pads on the graphics card is uh, obviously I, I don't do it perfectly. Uh, I know that there are a lot of other tech YouTubers out there um, that have other breakdown videos where they do it very precise in uh, using exacto knives and everything, all that fun stuff. Changing the thermal pads uh, to make the, the GPU cooler. Uh, I use Geely. Thermal pad will be in the description below. Uh, if you guys have any questions, uh, need some help on researching uh, your particular graphics card on th uh, thermal pad size or anything like that, uh, feel free to reach out. Notice uh, while I was doing the thermal pads, I repasted the core of the GPU, uh, the die. Uh, I usually use about a pea size, and I don't know if you noticed that I was using the little scraper thing uh, that was MX4 uh, thermal paste. I really like that thermal paste. It does help out a lot from what I've, what I've seen with uh, thermal pasting a lot of my cards. Uh, moral of the story with this particular card is when you get a used or new to you GPU, it might be best to take everything apart. Uh, I put this on our test bench for mining. I saw that it mined and I threw it in a rig and, and honestly, that's you know my bad. I should have actually taken it apart, cleaned it, done all the things a normal GPU miner done, which I normally do on my cards. This one, I got it extremely cheap, saw it worked and just threw it in a rig. Uh, and I should have known better. It started heating up recently, especially because it's getting hot where I'm at in Arizona. Um, so changing out the thermal pads. Again, if you guys got questions, feel free to reach out, comment below. Uh, if you like this video and need and want to see more content like this, uh, you know, hit the like button, subscribe, and yeah, until next time.